So I'm with Beth Newman at the University of Illinois, and she's going to talk to us a little about their project called the Rehome. Where'd you get that name from? Well, the concept for our project is a disaster relief home. So we went with the uh, name Rehome, sort of, to go along with the idea of, you know, reuniting um, a town that might have been struck by a, a natural disaster. Okay, well. and it looks like we have basically two rectangular structures that are kind of joined in the middle. What, how does yeah. that all, is that for transport, or how does that work? Exactly. So we divided our house into two modules for easy transport. Um, this way, the house can be pretty much prefabricated, which will not require much assembly once it reaches the site. Will it be in two pieces? You'll have two truckloads, basically? Yeah, but actually the two pieces could fit on one truck. Oh, okay. So. Okay, now tell us, what, what square footage are we at here? Um, the exterior square footage is about 985 square feet. Okay. Um, interior, about 780. So. Okay, and looks like you have all of your PV panels on a, is it a flat roof, or does it actually have some pitch to it underneath the panels? Um, there's a slight, a slight pitch just to allow for drainage. Okay. But, I mean, basically it'll look like a flat roof from ground level. And you won't be able, it looks like you won't be able to see the PV panels from the ground level either. Is that part of the design? Yeah, that's a little bit of our goal, sort of to keep with a more um, linear look to it. So. Okay. And it looks like we have a lot of sun shading out, and out a lot of outdoor spaces and a lot, like a lot of... Yeah. A lot of shading, is that what that's for? And also yeah. for sun shading for the summer versus winter? Exactly. So we wanted to have a lot of um, shading on the east and west sides, and then also the canopy in the front to allow for some um, sunlight in the winter, but to shade in the summer. So Great. And, and what do you expect? that? Do you expect you'll be able to stick in under the $250,000 bar? Yep, that's, bar? that's a big goal of ours. So right now we're... Thinking we're at about maybe two hundred thousand, but okay. the lower we can get our price, the better. So okay, great. Well, we look forward to seeing the final thing. Yep. Good luck, guys. Thanks.